So our cows are super tame and easy to get. And all it does is takes us picking up a wire of some sort or a string, or in this case, we're using the poly wire from Patriot. And we don't, it's not even hot. We just kind of walk through the field with it and gather the last stragglers to get them in the pen so we can breed. Come on, cavies. So as you can see, we got the girls in and we're just waiting for Justine with Ferguson Farm and Cattle to get here. And then we'll start running them through the chute yet again and breeding them. And if you haven't tuned in up to this point, we have two other videos that show the whole sink process. We do a 10 day sink process, starting with putting in cedars on day one with shots of GNRH. And then on day seven, pulling the cedars, giving a shot of estromate. And then today we're gonna run them through 64 hours after the last pulling and giving a shot. We'll breed them and give another shot of GNRH and then hopefully we'll have a bunch of babies next spring. So we're looking forward to it. What? Open one up quick, just set it right here and Justine. She did two at once. I didn't even realize it. She's that good. She has me starting to thaw for her. I'm big. Here you go. Come on. One you go. Come on. Okay. Right. Getting old. Yeah. Doesn't edit the sound out of this, does he? No. <laughs> it's all natural. I am the oldest one out of, out of all of my friends. Yeah. And he lost his hair when he was 18. <laughs> I know. I gotta put up with you. I know. Everybody's gotta put up with Big Mike. Maybe your 10th anniversary with Haya. I'm trying to think. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Nope. I think it's just the first year that we just breathed the tree or something like that. I think so.
may be your 10th anniversary with Aya. I'm trying to think. Yeah. Oh, Aya's she's big. With Aya, she... Oh. <laughs> I think it is because the first year, did we just breed the two or something like that? We did the old cow. I think so. What? 